Yeah. I'm going to read everyone a bedtime story and it's one of our favourites and it's called Good Little Wolf. Are we all sitting comfortably? Then let's begin. Good. Rolf and Mrs Boggins were best friends. You really are a good little wolf, Mrs Boggins told him. Rolf liked being a good little wolf. He liked baking tasty cakes. He ate up all his vegetables and he was always nice to his friends. But Mrs Boggins also said that not all wolves are good. In fact, some were downright bad. <sighs> Rolf hoped he would never bump into a big bad wolf. Now, what do we have here? said the big bad wolf. You look like a wolf. You, you smell like a wolf. That's because I am a wolf, piped up Rolf. I'm a very good little wolf. Good, said the big bad wolf. Wolves aren't good. Wolves are big and bad. Real wolves howl at the moon, hooted the big bad wolf. Real wolves blow houses in. Real wolves eat people up. Well, said Rolf, I am a real wolf and I'm sure I can do all of those things. So Rolf tried to howl at the moon. He pursed his lips, took a deep breath and out came a great big a little whistle. Yeah. Then Rolf went, Rolf went to see the little pigs. Do you mind if I blow your house in? asked Rolf. You can try I suppose said the little pig. So he huffed and he puffed but it was no use. I'm sorry Rolf said the little pig. You're right said Rolf sadly. I'm just not bad enough to be a wolf. Well, there is one last thing you can do to prove you're a proper wolf, said the big bad wolf. And suddenly, something quite strange came over Rolf. He felt an unfamiliar familiar wild feeling growing inside him. <gasps> Look, he's tying up the wolf. Rolf had never felt more like a wolf. Ah! Can you do it with it? Good one. See, I'm a proper wolf. I just happen to be a good little wolf, said Rolf. This calls for a celebration, cried Mrs Boggins. And they all sat down for some tea and cake. Will you stop eating people up, big bad wolf? asked Rolf. Oh, I suppose so, said the big bad wolf. <laughs> I'll stop first thing tomorrow. Where, where are they? Where's Mrs Boggins and the wolf and Rolf gone, would it? No. Where have they gone? In the tummy. In the tummy. <laughs> <laughs>